Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I have for you a thrift store haul. I went to two thrift stores and found some pretty cool things. So I want to show them to y'all. I went to hospice and I went to SCP, SPCA. There. So um, the first two items are from the previous haul that I did. The previous thrift store haul. There was two items that I left out and didn't show y'all. So, the first one is this wooden tray. This is from Target. This is Acacia tray. I don't know if you can see that. And it was $2, I believe. Oh, yeah. I think $2. So, that was a good buy. You can use that on your coffee table. You know, wherever you feel like using it. And then next, I found this a really nice pillow. Although I'm not really digging the cover. I don't know if you can tell, but it, I think it's green. So, um, their pillows are like a dollar. But what is in here is a down uh, pillow form. So, I can, um, although I don't like the outside pillow cover, pillowcase, I guess. I can take that off and just use the pillow form. And so for a dollar or for even two dollars for that matter, that is a great buy. So I did pick that up. And uh, like I said, that was for my previous haul. So the next items, I will start with hospice. I spent $4.23 at hospice. And I did come out with some pretty cool items. Um, first, I picked up this... Well, it's tangled. I just spit. It's a really long. I don't know that it is necessarily a necklace. They had it with the necklaces. But this does not feel like it's chain. It feels like it's material. So, I don't know what I'll use it for. But I did pick that up. Let me hang it on the chair. This doesn't tangle up again. Next, I picked up this really cute Precious Moments. Um little makeup it says you make me blush it was a yellow sticker I'm not sure how much it was but I did pick this up for my oldest daughter she is absolutely loves makeup and when uh, she was a baby I had her room done in precious moments so I picked that up for her to put on her makeup table um, so I was excited to find that next I picked up this a little um, tea light holder I don't uh, candle holders were 50% uh, off so this was probably 75 cents I did have to remind her because she had originally charged me a dollar 25 so it's not really a, uh, anyway um so anyway I picked this up uh the spare room I'm doing is gonna have a lot of greens in it so I thought this would look cute on uh, one of the shelves. So I picked that up. Next, I picked up some vintage um, Thinking of You cards. These are from the New Hope Bookstore. I'm not sure where that's at, but I was excited to get these. They were 75 cents. And they are just super cute, super yellowed. Or they may be just yellow to begin with. It says, I was thinking of you. I thank my God, making mention of the always in my prayers, um, Philemon 1, 14, uh, one, uh, chapter 1 and 4. So, I was excited to get those, and I thought those were really cute. Next, they had their, sorry, I'm all up in the camera. Next, they had their board games, three for a dollar. So, I picked up this funk. Fun, funglish. I really just wanted it for the cards that come in it. It's a box full of all different kinds of cards. These cards can be used um, for um, junk journals. There's just tons of all different kinds of cards. So these can be used for tabs for um, all, any all kinds of stuff anyway so I did pick that up let's say these were 33 cents each next I picked up this 
Family Feud. This one is vintage for sure. I don't know what year it is, but I, I can tell by the box that it is vintage. Um, it has all these papers that came with it, so I'm thinking I can probably use these somehow in a junk journal. So I picked that up. And then last but not least is what really got me going, and it was this old maid game. How awesome is that? Um, I don't know what year this is, but I just have a feeling this is from like when I was a kid. It looks like something that would have been from my era. Check that out. Isn't that fun? Love it. And it comes with all these cards. Super cute. Love them. Um, I always played Old Maid. Me and my mother, my mom would play games with me. And Old Maid was one of the games that we would play. So, I liked that. So, that was all the things that I got at hospice. Like I said, it was like $4.23. So, awesome buys. The next part of it was SPCA. It was $11.64. So, I did pick up this wooden elephant. I think I will. Um, he's really scratched up. I'm thinking I will probably chalk paint him and uh, use him. He has his trunk up, which is for good luck. And he was 20 yeah, there, 25 cents. So, I uh, got that. Next, I found this. I had seen it. I passed over it the last three times I was there. I had it in my bag. I put it back, but I went ahead and picked him up. He was 50 cents, and he is from the company Wick and Sticks. So, I want to give this, get it cleaned up really good, and give this to my sister. My sister loved that store, Wick and Sticks. It was in our mall when I was young um i don't know it just reminds me of her um not this so much as that so i think she will she will like it or at least it'll bring back a good memory for because she loved to go in that store um so next i found this quilt no not quilt crocheted afghan this is native american motif and it is a really cool um, I can't tell if y'all can tell it is just really neat and I picked it up I'm not sure how much they charged me for it but I know it wasn't much um, super cool little lap quilt um, so I was excited to get that Next, I picked up some uh, blue um, eyelet material. I liked that. Let's see. I picked up this purse for, it was $1. It just needs some conditioning. It is really nice leather. I cannot find a maker's mark in it anywhere or a brand. It is really clean. Oh, let me see. Oh, I don't know. I don't know what that means. I do see that. It says 220. I know it's backwards to y'all, maybe. I don't know. I'm going to do some, some looking and see what I come up with. But anyway, I was excited to find it. A little bit of leather conditioner, and I think this would be a really cute little purse. I picked that up. Next, I picked up this vintage level it is a working level I picked that up I like to turn these into shelves and I have some that we got when we cleaned out our neighbor's house um, and they're in my bedroom let me show you what I'm talking about Oh goodness. Oh goodness. 
goodness, oh goodness. Oh gosh, that's even worse. Let's see if I can do this without hitting the gas again. Okay, I don't know if y'all can see them, but I have them on. Um, <laughs> oh well, anyway, you get the picture. They're, I, I make them into shelves. So, super cute, easy little shelf. Um, so, I was excited to find that. That was for $3. And then, last but not least, I found this no smoking sign 75 cents somebody made it out of a junk piece of board but there was two of them i can tell it's vintage and i just thought it was something fun to um put out on my porch i don't know why anyway i'm weird but i found that so next i found this little bracelet i think it's just a souvenir bracelet that somebody picked up but I liked this charm it's Grant's home Galena Illinois I think anyway so I picked that up I'm gonna clean it up and see there's some more charms on it I guess has to do with that um, at that home so anyway guys that's my haul that's what I found I'm happy with all the things that I got um, my favorite find probably is the Old Maid game. I, I really think that is um, pretty cool to find that. And then the next is the Native American. I hope I said Native American. Crocheted Afghan. Um, I thought that was really cool too. So anyway, guys, I hope you're having an amazing day. For some reason, it is hot in my house right now. I need to turn a fan on. And... Y'all have a great day. Please give my video a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button. Become part of my YouTube family and friends. I would love to have each and every one of y'all join the family here on my channel. Alright guys, y'all take care. Bye.